Hey yo, welcome back everybody to the final episode of part of Game Breakers Week 3. I finally caught up on the episodes that I missed. But yeah, we are here. Hold up, something don't look right. But yeah, we are back here. We got a little challenge ahead of us. Now, the goal for today's episode is to uh, assemble the Avengers with the given mods, vanities, and armors that we have. And the goal is to make them as accurate as possible. And uh, we're going to see how good we can do here. But first, we need to go to the character creation screen. We are here in the character creation screen. And we are going to start with the easiest Avenger, just Hulk. That's all. We're going to do Hulk. Now, his hair, obviously black. I don't know if they got the exact hairstyle that Hulk has we're just gonna go with something simple like that i don't even know if you guys can see that it's really dark and it's really far away and then we're gonna go ahead skin of course green skin like hulk what color skin does he have in the mcu i'm gonna base most of this off of the mcu we'll, we'll say like that's a good green and then uh we should go from there the only thing we're gonna do here is just the skin color i'm not gonna do pants i'm not gonna do anything else because we're gonna do that we're gonna try our best to do that with vanity so let's go ahead get back into the game all right so this is where the challenge part comes in because we had to use all the armor sets and vanities that we have to make them look as close as the incredible hulk as possible now i don't think there's a uh, very many shorts in terraria at least i don't remember i'm gonna also try and stay away from using dyes as best as possible unless i absolutely have to use a die unless something looks so weird that i have to use it can we stop being attacked by enemies all right so yeah let's go ahead let's see what we can put on here now the first thing i think we should put on is probably this the sunflower tops because this is obviously full green the thing is does it match my skin color green kind of kind of we look kind of weird but uh you know it does match the body good enough what happens okay so let's look together here and the video is probably con gonna consist of a montage of me looking through the vanity stuff yeah let's look through here maybe the karate tortoise show nah it's got that abs honestly i feel like we need the abs on the body to look like hulk like that that's probably the number one i don't think looking like a cactus is gonna work i don't think any of these chest plates are gonna work but since our body is green maybe try the dryad coverings that's not bad that's not bad at all but i know there's some stuff i know there's some outfits in this game either from thorium or some other mod that you can put on your chest and you have like abs and stuff showing oh right here maybe the exiles garb okay not bad the only problem is obviously that it shows on the character but maybe we can get rid of it with dye okay so let's try the pants we got a greedy pants here oh that's not bad already yo that's kind of close that's kind of close all right let, let's try out everything else no that's robes uh no no and i'm assuming this one's gonna be a no too yeah but this is not bad because you could also see his feet kind of because they're green feet these are uh, greedy this greedy outfit is based off of uh wario so that works out there the green shoes does wario have green shoes i didn't know he had green shoes but we're pretty close maybe put on the exiles garb L let's try this again the sunflower tops okay never mind we look, we look like fucking swamp thing so this is pretty good but i think to make it perfect we are gonna have to use dye because that's the only way now the question is do we dye it the same color as us yeah that doesn't look bad at all so i think we accomplished the hulk let's now go back to the character screen and let's show off the next character so our next character is gonna be thor the thing is we had to go in game and talk to the stylist because obviously there's not any good looking cuts for thor this is the closest i can get in the character select so i guess we'll go with that this skin color is pretty normal but i have a very interesting idea we might do for thor here that might resemble you know his comic book some of his comic book looks rather than his mcu look so let's go ahead let's hop back into the game all right so for thor i have a pretty good idea of what to use here and uh you know it comes pretty simple given that a certain update came out for Tori a while back a, a long while back and this update is the old ones army update and it adds in as guardian stuff is it called as guardian stuff what is it called guardian oh i'm spelling guardian wrong that's why okay maybe it's not even called that i think it's just called viking is it viking okay it's not viking either there's something that look, looks like thor here it is valhalla that's what it's called so this this, I feel like is a very easy cop out, but like, can you blame me? There you go. <laughs> this Thor. Nah, that's, it, I mean, it kind of looks like Thor, like the female Thor, because I think the female Thor helmet looks like this, but it doesn't look like Thor Thor. You know what I'm saying? So let's go with the viking helmet because i think this is gonna be way better for him uh boom looks good already may i may i have to do more may i need to do more i don't know what i'm saying we don't have the long flowing locks i don't think it matters though honestly this this is looking more like i don't know what this looks like honestly doesn't really look like his mcu one doesn't really look like his comic book one but uh you know what close enough and now we need something for the chest and the legs so maybe we should base this one off of the comic books and get some blue pants and then 
a red chess piece. Now, I know his chess piece isn't exactly red, but he has a cape that's red. Oh, we could just do that. We just put a cape. What is a cape? What are capes under? Cloaks? Are they called cloaks? No. Okay. I swear, aren't they just called capes? Cape. They are just called capes. All right. Red cape boom so there you go there's his his cape do we actually even need anything else because like I, we'll get the blue pants the blue pants at least so we just need to find some blue pants here okay here we go this might work the apprentice trousers that might work you know that does look like the blue kind of honestly it might be a lighter blue we do need something for the chest i feel like the chest doesn't look right let's try the squire plating no that doesn't work either hmm Hmm. Okay, I think I just might have found something. So I switched the cape to the cape of the survivor from Thorium. And I tried the ninja shirt. Ninja shirt doesn't work too well. But then I saw the beetle scale mill and the beetle shell. Obviously, the shell probably won't look as good. Yep, because it takes away the cape and puts an actual shell. But the scale mill. Now, this looks pretty damn close. Not only does it look close, like, visually, sprite-wise. But when we put it on the character, it's not too bad. But I think we we'll probably will have to die this one. Like I said, I'm trying to stay away from dying as much as I can because i feel like dying honestly we can just die everything it'll be spot on now that doesn't look right i don't know oh wait i think i might have found it the gladiator's breastplate i was looking for something that shows the hands and this shows the hands put the black dye on it oh this might be it this honestly might be it this looks pretty good i think we're gonna stick with it i think the black dye on the gladiator's breastplate looks the best and now let's go ahead let's summon in the uh stylus here and let's see if we can get the uh correct hairstyle just like normal long hair or do we want to go for like viking you know with the beard and everything Thing. i don't know now the thing is we need long hair that doesn't get stuck that's actually not that bad we need long hair that kind of swoops on top of the armor like that there we go now he looks more like a female but uh it's all good oh i don't even have any gold <laughs> all right now that the funds are in my pocket i could actually uh purchase the hairdo where did it go boom so either this i mean it's not bad or we can go like i said with the full beard viking look which would probably be like something like this it's kind of what he looks like in endgame but i think this is probably one of the best styles we got so far i'm thinking this is even better than the hulks all right Alright, so next we're gonna be doing Tony Stark, also known as Iron Man. Now, his MCU outfit obviously changes every movie. So this one shouldn't be too hard. It's, it's really just a dude in a suit. See, this is why I'm not able to record videos. There's always construction work going on. But yeah, like I said, I think this is probably going to be the easiest one. Obviously, the hairstyle is not going to be too accurate. We don't really need to spend much time doing that because we're not going to be looking at his face too much. Oh, that's a pretty close one. This one right here, kind of close, right? I don't know. Tony Stark got some weird hairstyle. I don't have gold anyways. But yeah, this one should not be too bad. I think the hardest thing to replicate is going to be the uh, color scheme. The color scheme and the helmet. So we got to find something that looks pretty spot on. If not spot on, close enough. You know what I'm saying? But maybe we should start with this actually maybe we should start with the dyes so black and gold or not black and gold red and gold is there even a gold option this is gold money hair dye no, no no we don't need no money hair dye we need a red and gold see yeah i don't even think we're gonna be able to find a red and gold dye oof why is there so many like red and black dyes there's no like a maybe flame dye i don't know all right so i got a pretty good base i'm pretty sure there was a point in time where his armor was red and silver that might just be the comic books though because i swear to god i remember his armor being red and silver at some point but yeah yeah, red and silver is the best we're gonna get instead of red and gold and then i got the tide turner set from thorium which comes out really good like so far i'm very happy with this and let's see now what helmet we can put on we sh it shouldn't be too bad let me put that dye there oh what about this okay that's isn't it's pretty close it's not the greatest looking but it's pretty close at the same time because iron man do, does have those two slits where his eyes are so that's actually not too bad i feel like one more thing is missing to make this complete so let's go ahead let's turn it on oh yeah all right so now we are moving on to captain america also known as steve rogers also known as steven rogers i actually don't know if they call him steven rogers but yeah we're gonna do him next he has some blonde hair right that's close enough his hair i mean it looks like that it's pretty much the same one we use for iron man but yeah there you go let's hop into it all right i feel like captain america is gonna be another hard one to do uh mainly because it's gonna be hard to get the colors blended together i don't know if there's any dyes that are silver blue and red like that's kind of hard maybe we can get silver and blue and then red and silver so we might have to do like a mix and match oh i don't know how this is gonna work bro i don't know how this is gonna work i feel like it's not gonna okay we're, let's try our best to just get the set first off for the helmet specifically we're gonna need pretty much something that looks like a ski mask so uh let's find something like that this is 
is pretty close to a ski mask, right? The the mummy mask. <laughs> Maybe if I can't find a mask, we'll just do Steve Rogers slash Captain America without a hat. Honestly, that might be the easiest way, the easiest cop out. Maybe we can even do Nomad, you know, where he wears the all black outfit. We might have to do that if I cannot find a ski mask. And it's looking like I'm not going to be able to find a ski mask. Okay, well, we got something. We got something. This is the Shinobi Infiltrator. And look at it. It looks pretty damn close, doesn't it? It looks pretty damn close. The only thing is the color. Maybe the dyes aren't gonna be the right color i don't know do we have any lighter colors okay that's kind of getting closer to captain america's color kind of so i think we'll stick with the uh sky blue dye now the thing is obviously his chest piece is blue red and white i i don't know how i'm gonna find anything blue red and white let me just type in patriot okay nothing comes up for patriot american yeah okay my all my stuff comes up wait a minute can we use my stuff hold up <laughs> we might be not even close i think honestly at this point we might just have to go with the nomad look because i don't know he's looking more like a ninja than he is a uh, captain america and i'm having troubles finding the right mask all right i don't know does this look pretty close i went with the full beetle set and then for the american star in the middle or i don't know why i said american star for the star in the middle i just put the family heirloom with the black and white dye because there's no white dye right there's no just full white dye i mean it looks pretty close i feel like i could do better on the armor though so let me try a little bit better on the armor all right i think this works we went back to the shinobi infiltrator set because that looks the cleanest honestly this is really a lot of the armor sets from the old ones army are really cool but yeah this one looks really clean you can also see his hand too which is exactly what you can see for captain america you can see his fingers i think in most of the things you can see his fingers but yeah this is the best we're gonna do for this it does have a little cape behind him but let me know in the comments this is all we're doing we're doing in my opinion the big four i wasn't gonna do black widow but we're gonna save her for a future video we're definitely gonna do more of these because i like this little challenge this, this made me think a little bit you know how many minutes i didn't record all of it i probably definitely won't include all of it but i sat like a good five minutes ten minutes for each character just looking and trying to figure out some good armor sets but let me know in the comments some combos you guys think are good and let me know what characters you want to see in the next video we do like this because this was really fun i enjoyed this a lot but i hope you guys enjoyed the avengers are gonna assemble on the screen now pop up on the screen i don't know i, I hope they do unless i forgot to edit it i could hear you guys crying from a mile away you guys really thought i forgot the most important thing about captain america well since he's nomad he didn't really have this but his shield of course of course his shield this is the best color i can get it captain america's shield he would not be complete without it even though in during the mcu when he was nomad he didn't really have one who's coughing in my ear shut the fuck up y'all want to see something cooler captain america's shield go Woo! But yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video i will see y'all in the next episode this is the last video of gamer this week three uh make sure to follow me on twitch i might be streaming either today or tomorrow and uh, i love you guys happy pride month i will see y'all next time